Hello everyone, I am the Dave. What's your Christmas tradition? Mine apparently is every Christmas Eve, or close to it, I play Kane and Lynch 2. I don't know why I started doing this, but it is something that I have been doing for a while. I'm going to turn the gain down on my microphone so I'm not blowing out your eardrums. Hmm. So yeah, I don't know if we're going to be playing the whole game or if we're just going to be playing 20 minutes, but every year I install this game and attempt to play through it. I've only completed it once. So, yeah. Uh, this is a game that I think people are appreciating a whole lot more now than they did back in the day. It was sort of instrumental in inspiring, or at least in my brain, it sort of inspired a number of games that are come out more recently. I forget what that one is called. It's that one, that helmet cam looking game that people say, oh, it's so realistic and scary stuff. It looks like Kane and Lynch 2 with a helmet cam. Anyway, and also Max Payne 3. There's a lot of people kind of talking about that, but you know what? No more ado, no more anything. If the screen looks weird, it's because I had to record it in 16 by 9. So yeah, medium. I don't know if this has mouse acceleration or anything else. I hope it doesn't. Actually, I just hope the v image isn't stretched for me. It might be. I don't think it is. All the text is going to be stretched. Let him go. No, the circles. Oh! It's one way to get your blood tested. Lynch. Don't fucking kill you. Yeah, I thought I enabled subtitles. Apologies if there's no subtitles. Some games don't like this resolution. Especially since this came out in what? 2010, 2011, something like that? A lot of games didn't really even know this resolution and aspect ratio existed. Hey, hon. You back home? Okay. No, I'm still waiting for Kane. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be good to see him again. Will it? Long time. Look, uh, I'll call you later. We'll eat all three. Yeah. You all three me. what? Bye. Oh, Sue. What? Oh, shit. oh. <laughs> well, I guess Sue is, uh... Well, there's like three jokes that came to my head. Whatever. Something else kind of funny about the PC port is, um, this game makes it so dual monitors or multiple monitors is impossible because it bla blacks out all the ones that you're not using. So I have no idea if this is getting recorded or anything, but uh, if this uh, fails in any way, I'll just upload the Far Cry 3 video I have recorded. Things I'd like to go through with him. Yeah, yeah. But this way. You know, I see a few problems with the deal that need to be looked at. Sure, sure. How's your daughter? She's fine. I, I mean, after what she went through, <laughs> I said she's two. Fine. Okay, don't start fucking around. Okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm sorry. If there's anything this game is really good, is presentation. A lot of its texture work and stuff is not aged, but there. voice acting Laser and I guess good. detail. This is a very detailed game, and there's not a whole lot of games that. Look like there's really no game that looks exactly like this. It's like sleeping dogs meets filth. I made me a really strong cup of coffee, which means I'm gonna be probably a in a mental asylum by the end of the day. But you know what? It's for the content, for the vine, for all this stuff. And if it keeps my voice up and my energy going, at least until I peter out and pass out then it's all for the best okay, i need to get a fish eye lens on this thing listen uh this field of view just need to talk at least the wheels are round i gone, think okay? oh no be careful this is mob turf oh this game is stretched is out live? mother of the crap all right maybe i should have gotten the widescreen patch oh well okay <laughs> Just makes this game look even more authentically awful. Get back. Hell is this? Well, I'll be damned. Honestly, it is just the gameplay that is bad about this you game. Everything me? else I think is so unique. Son of a bitch! Here, take this. 
You're kidding. Just in case. Ah, we gotta catch him. Come on. I knew just in case once. Uh, C to get in cover. Okay. Find cover! Maybe I can crop this. Maybe I can fix the resolution and everything in post. Hell if I know. Keep going. I see that you're still insane, Lynch. Yeah, something like it. Okay. Come back here! Brady, goddammit! Yeah, Brady! Don't get your me. dynamically lit ass back here. Don't mind us. Is there a back way in here? Now they didn't translate it, so not even Lynch knows what the heck they're saying. Uh-oh. The and there's aspects of the game that I think are fine. Like, it's not the best cover system. Like, it's very sticky. But you can freely choose to stand up or down whenever you are in cover. Like, you don't have to leave cover to stop crouching or anything. Come which on, stuff like Uncharted way. did not let you do. Hell, even GTA 4 didn't let you do that. I don't know. Woo! I hope you're not getting motion sickness because it's a freaking Disney ride rodeo up in this hizzy. Pre hold W and press C to vault. Oh. Was a jump button really that difficult? Or like a vault? Cause the animation's there. Oh boy. Out of my way. Alright. Brady! Lynch! Lynch! You reckon if there's more than one of them, they're the Brady bunch? Oh my lord. I can't see! Oh no! Get moving! Okay. Even though there's no, I, there's no punishment for shooting civilians. There's still non-combatants, so you'll waste your ammo on shooting things you're not supposed to shoot if you're not careful. And the mouse sensitivity on this is fucking cactus. Alright. And I want that Desert Eagle for as long as possible. Wow. I remember the aiming being a whole lot worse. It's the principle. Sure. People always talk about the principle, but no one ever talks about the administrator. Oh, what? Okay. Camera got kind of funky there. I didn't really know what I was looking at. Die. Oh, you freaking munch. Neat. That's one death. Yeah! Oh, did the same thing again. I'm pushing every wrong button to get in the cover. Oi! Oh my lord! Oh, I play this game every year. I figured this would I figured this would work out, but I also did not have this monitor last time I even attempted to play this. Oh boy. So I guess treat this more tactically. Fun thing about this game though is Square Enix and IO Interactive are behind this. Now if you're unfamiliar with IO Interactive, they're the guys behind Hitman. So they they like their really dismal, like dirty and depressing games. Well I say that. I've not played Hitman beyond like uh, I played a little bit of Absolution many years ago, but the moment I discovered that I could just whip out a shotgun and start shooting everybody, oh goodness, just start shooting everybody, I was sort of like, yeah, I'm not getting very far into this. Whoa, get down, civvies! There's an English colloquialism where civvies mean underwear. So I'm essentially telling the underwear to get down. Be dropping more panties than Michael J. Fox out of Victoria's Secret. Get out of here. Mouse sensitivity is completely screwed, but it's functional. I really like the fact that the Mac 
Mac 10, whatever this is. I really like the. Is he still not dead? I really like the fact that it's uh, that it shoots an irresponsibly fast amount of shots. Woo! I almost worded that correctly, and then I borked it. Oh well. Yeah, what he said. Toggle crouch. Not really seeing that much of a point. Let's get my accurate shot. For that reason. Is this where it introduces gas canisters? Yeah! Now what? Pick up and throw? I I'm picking it up. Oh, E to throw. Well, that's one way to do it. Anyway. I'd rather just, uh... I mean, I'm going to assume... Yeah, just auto-aims. Whatever, I don't want to be back here. I want to be in the action! You can shoot gas canisters to make them explode. Maybe not that one, and maybe aim is just so bad. Now, I don't have a very good backup. I mean, I have 10... Oh, wait, it, this, this game doesn't account for... No, well, this game does account for what you have in the mag. So that's 10 in reserve. Which is nice. Wait, wait, wait. I saw ammo. Give me that. Do it. Is that ice? I did not come all the way out for this. Oh, well, that's your problem. Uh, yeah, let's get the shotgun. Shotgun will get you through most of this game. If I remember it correctly. All right. Up where? Um, O reveals weapons. I think it was Y? Oh, Y focuses camera on objective. Neato! Wow, he's a... Uh, you know, if someone looked like that when they were selling crabs, not only would I respect it, but I would buy hey! some. Good. We got him. He's trapped. He ain't going nowhere. Just tell me, and I'll put a fucking bullet in him. Don't kill him! What about the girl? We let her go. We're coming in! Uh, coming in where? You're out in the open. She died as she lived, okay. lying down with her done. pants off. Now come on, let's talk. Hey, relax. Jesus. What just happened? Did he just... Yeah. What the fuck just happened? What happened is he took the less efficient route. He had a gun. Either that or he was out. Yeah, let's get your luggage. Came, saw, conquered. Guy ran a knife across his throat, Laser. gave up, went home. Yeah, he's here. You'll take us to the docks now? All right, great. I think this is the limo mission. Which, um... Yeah, how I died the first couple times on that one uh, encounter. We're about to see a whole heck of a lot more of that. Because, uh, this... I never do this one right first try. Dude, Kane's got good textures. I don't know about that that uh head unit though. Oh boy. GTA motherfucker. Okay, I'll help you out by uh, trying to flank him. Oh, yeah, that would have that would have it would have been very smart for me to uh, have checked my blind spot. 
Oi! Okay, that was not Kane. Alright. Well, that's somebody. Get sit down. Despite the fact this is a mag fed shotgun, I think he reloads it one shot at a time, like an idiot. Ah! Black it. Oi! Okay. Sit rep. Foobar. Alright. So there was a number of games that I was planning on playing after uh, Mirror's Edge. Uh, this was not one of them, but I recorded a Far Cry 3 session quite a few days ago and have not finished or have not uploaded it maybe i uploaded it and i just hadn't published it i don't remember but uh i figured if any if, if anything went wrong then i could oh monkeys am i dead no okay but i figured if uh anything went wrong yeah, we'll swap it. Then uh, I could play like uh, Spec Ops The Line or something. Come on, get move on. Now, this is the part that I usually get killed on. And I'll let you guess why. You have to dodge them. And, well, yeah. We did it! Hooray! And the party's not over yet. Oi! Get up! Oh, get away. Get over here. Get go somewhere. How about that? Wow. The Scorpion sucks less than the Mac 10. This might be the only game in history where that's the case. It doesn't matter what game I've played, be it this, Hot Dogs Worst Shoes Hand Grenades, or one minute in Metal Gear Solid 3. Whatever. The Scorpion sucks. I know it was in Black Ops 1. And it sucked there too. Blazer's dead. Oh. Okay, so I had I had to pull him out of the car. That's good to know. Oh. Oh boy. Get a move on! Okay. Press E to succeed. It's like Overwatch. Now it looks like enemies will funnel around. God dang it. It look, I think, uh, enemies like ragdoll, even if they're not dead. So it's a little bit difficult to tell if they're dead or not. Oh boy. This is an example of, you know what? I'll go so, I'll go so far as to say this game actually has better shooting controls and everything than the Mafia 1 remake. Because that game, enemies just don't react to getting shot. So you're sitting there just floundering, trying to get something done. In this game, at least you can make them flinch. And there's blood decals, and there's all this other stuff that indicates you are indeed putting the hurt on someone. I also kind of like the fact that Ragdolls seem to have a decent sense of gravity. That's not some place we want to be. Um... So they kind of drop like a lead balloon. Come on. Now I don't know what button would let me change my... Which shoulder I'm looking over. Should have set that. This really was just kind of like I woke up today. It was like, guess what we're doing? Oh, hey, boy. There is blind fire. I'm glad it's been working out. All right. What we got? Okay. I want to have a slightly better automatic. What the fuck just happened? I don't know. You shut it. Get that bloody door open. We're gonna have a sodding heart attack. You can tell he's from a European country because of the lingo. You know, I died several times. I don't know what you're talking about. We need a plan. 
Uh, the plan is wait until enemies spawn and then throw this freaking fire extinguisher. Uh, BR549. That's me. We're in a, in a situation. I need a pickup. Yeah, yeah. You might need the latch as well. Well, I don't fucking care if your mum's got fucking head cancer. Well, you just. Humor? Yeah. Question mark? What? What's, the, what's the location? Can I ask Here. Did you get that? 21 Mali Lu. Molly Lule Lo. Shit! All right, we'll just get down here. Right, the pickup is on the way. We gotta hurry. This is Sting territory. Sting? You're fucking kidding. I can't carry a tune in a basket. So, are we sticking around or are we just running? Did I just waste a bunch of time? I sure did. Oh, Lord. Alright. I love shootouts in parking garages. Because I like... I like it when the detail's good enough to where, like, a bunch of windows are shattering and a bunch of other things. It just makes some very lovely detail. Actually, just anything involving a lot of cars getting shot up in a gunfight, I love Tangentially related, uh, Michael Mann's Heat has the single best gunfight I've ever seen. It's after the, uh, it's after the, uh, the bank heist. Which, of course it is. Everyone who's seen that movie knows the bank heist gunfight. Good lord. That movie practically created GTA V. Alright. Don't want to... There will be another shotgun. I'd rather be able to... Put some down range. Aye! Alright. And there's ammo. That's always a plus. Mouse sensitivity is a bit high. Okay. This is one of those games that I've kind of kind of tried to get Steam Friends to get because it does have full co-op. But how do you recommend this game to somebody? Oh, it's a it's a nauseating, gritty, depressing, whatever the hell's going on over here. It has co-op. Okay, so I think someone's like behind that van putting some shots off. Sustained gunfire in this game just isn't a thing. Oh, crowd! Or er, control is how you crowd. Neato. Oh, blew him up through the wall. I'll be madder than Christmas if I end up dying in uh, this late to this fight. Okay, you get down. Do not get back up. Okay. I'm tired of this. It's gonna be okay. Is it? All right. Uh, co-op door. Co-op door. Yeah. Man, with this fucking field of view and this uh, aspect ratio, when we get to the laundry, laundromat, something, there's one part that I get lost into at a with a smaller screen. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'd say someone needs to fix the door, but I think they need to fix what's beyond the door first. Keep a lookout. Boy should be waiting on the other side of that building. Should be. I mean, really. Comes to show what post processing could do for making something look, I guess, quote unquote, realistic. Because I've seen pictures of the Kowloon Walled City and stuff like that, and it, it, like, this looks like about as good as games need to be in order to get that point across. But I'd argue that this, this was my favorite era of gaming. Not necessarily, you know, the litany of cover shooters or anything like that, but I'm talking like the 360 and PS3 era. Because with modern computing, you can have visuals that look this good. And by this good, I mean 
this looks like really gritty footage and photographs. Or convincingly so. And then you just couple that with the capability of processors being able to do a bunch of dynamic lights and ray tracing and stuff like that. You could end up having something look absolutely fantastic. And you don't even need the best textures. Like, texture quality is lovely. I mean, Cyberpunk 2077 might actually be my game of the year. I'd have to kind of look over some. Because I think there was maybe, like, one other thing that would be a hot contender of that. But... I think Cyberpunk's gonna clip it. But anyway. Um... And... This is as good as games kind of need to look. They just, like, these textures are good enough. Character models could be a little sharper. But that's the thing. The texture, the texture quality just kind of improves the resolution, but you don't necessarily need much more detail than this. I think, oh, I thought there was still a guy up there. All right. The rest of us will keep an eye out. All right. Oh, I think this is the freaking, oh, we're not there yet. Actually, what's funny is uh, this game came out around the time that I was turning 18, I think. And my mom, my mom knew games better than a lot of parents did. She was just, she operated more on feeling than logic. So to her, if it was rated mature, we weren't allowed to play it. But for whatever reason, this game, maybe it was because I had an interest in filmmaking and other stuff but when i was telling her about like the presentation and whatever she actually gave the okay to uh maybe play this and use it as kind of like a filmmaking observing dissection practice but i didn't play it until many years later who are who's shooting I don't even know where that came from. Ah, bugger, we gotta do this again. Merry Christmas! Here comes Santa. <laughs> well, crackhead Santa. Oh! That weapon, that was some Counter-Strike weapon spread. Still got the headshot, though. <laughs> so, in many ways, uh, your mouse sensitivity doesn't really matter here. Because you're going to miss pretty much every shot you take anyway. So hey, instead of worrying about mouse sensitivity, just kind of aim in the general direction. <laughs> Two megabytes per second. Okay. So instead of running in like a turd, I'm going to try to stick back a little bit more logically. Tactically, a lot more calmly, and just try to get this stuff done. The the actual hitbox to register a headshot is freaking stupid. Because I'm, I'm like hitting them in the neck. Neck shots don't matter for peanuts in this game. Alright. Also, I remember the sound mixing being a little better, but... Maybe I'm just spoiled. Hey. That's a lot of popo. -po. One coming up on the right. I really want to swap sides here. That may have been a bad choice. Get Glazer to the getaway van. Um. How clear does it need to be? Because Getaway Van is a little bit, uh, not in a good mood right now. Let's go. You! Get down and sing a song for me. I will pay you in advance. With bullets. Okay, book it! Get him to the Getaway Van! The dude made his way there! Hmm. Right 
I could have sworn the audio didn't load there. That was weird. You'd think, considering IO Interactive is Dutch, they would know that uh, the Brits don't exactly say bloody this and sodding that every other sentence. Some might. It's like the Australian stereotype of saying can't as like a full stop. I mean, that exists in like the Bogan area. Look, I'll call you. I know. But we ran into some trouble. Is this the area? Ah, this is the part that's on the PS3 demo that I played like 497 times. Yeah. I'll, I'll be there. I promise. Okay, I'll call you later. There might be puke Bye. on my shirt, though, because this uh, field of view is low. All right. Don't worry. We'll see you later, Glazer. Wait, what? Oh, no, we're getting to the rest. Oh, we haven't done the freaking laundromat crazy maze game. Stupid freaking I hate everything. All right. Let's go ahead and bleed out some Mac ammo. Oh, I thought my reticle wasn't showing up. I can't shoot without that. Although, I could turn off the subtitles and the reticle and then turn on the, the uh, reticle overlay that my stupid gaming monitor has. Improve your aim with our assisted tools. The only one I use is the reticle because I can turn on a reticle when I'm using a sniper rifle in Counter-Strike. That way I know where my scope's gonna be. And no one can can prove it. Oh, who expected that? Me. Whoa! There's what, 30, 32 rounds in a Mac 10 magazine? Or Mac 11? Which is it? One of them's... Wait a minute. Well, uh, one of them's a 380, one of them's a 45. Although I could have sworn one was a 9. Was it the one that FPS Russia used at once? Wasn't that a 9? Or have they always been 380s? Well, regardless. 380 is literally just a short 9. I have a Walther PPK and it reads uh, 380 ACP slash 9mm Kurtz. Which is apparently German for short. Uh, and crack dens. Quiet. We will later. No. When you called me out here, you said this deal was bulletproof. I lied. So they can be sold by the jackal. keep it down. might have some kind of beef with us, okay? We just gotta find out why. Okay, there's only. I'm just gonna kind of follow Kane a little bit. What do we do? Grab him. Okay. Yoink. Not gonna hurt you. Don't shoot him. Okay, human shield. I remember in the PS3, it was either the shield. In its totality? Or the ability to execute that you couldn't do in the PS3 demo. Also, enemies really don't care if you have a human shield. They will just... They will just blast right through you. Oi, 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 Yeah, screw you. Alright. Gotta use my own ammo now. What is that? Oh, that's a shoddy. Come on out, Johnny. I've got a present for you. Crackhead Santa's coming to town. And he's got a lump of lead for your ass. <laughs> uh, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. Ah, Mary. Hello again. My name is Cheese. Get on your knees. Oh, quit hollering. Your life is only shortened by several, probably, days in this neighborhood. As opposed to, you know... Whoa, hang on. Do you want to shoot your friend? Well, 
I can do that without you. I don't need your help. Now you can speak English now. Oh! How's that? How's that for shooting? Oh. Imagine if you... Imagine if you were holding someone hostage and you missed the execution. You could never work in this industry again. You know, blind firing is just not something that's really viable in real life. Oh! Now that's a shotgun. And while this doesn't have the range that a real life shotgun would, it is kind of one of the better shotguns in games, at least in terms of being convincing. Where are we? Don't know. Because it Just feels it way. feels right for the level design. That's probably a city. Okay, so I think we can go around. Can we take cover at this wall? Well, we could take cover kind of in the part of the wall I didn't want to be in. Actually, we may have to. I'm not. Yeah, I'm going around. Whoa! Hello. Oh, come on. Stand up and shoot like a real man. Or get shot from a window like a bitch. Alright. Come on. Yeah, bad idea. Whoa! Some of these environments remind me a little bit of Escape from Tarkov, which I've never played. It's one of those games that I really want to play. But I saw that video on hackers and the fact that it's an online FPS and all this other stuff, which is just not one of those things that I'm really into. Uh, it just wouldn't be a smart idea. Plus, I don't know if or when it goes on sale because it's not on Steam. He didn't make it. Oh, uh, his head became strawberry jam. Oh, I should have been shooting. All right, I'd be shooting. Ah, bollocks. I'm not even the right nationality to say bullocks. But at least they can't call me racist. Okay, I really have no idea what the button is to switch shoulders. Is it Q? No, Q switches weapons. Hang on, what's the button for that? Peek on. Uh, cycle weapons, reload, sprint, blah, 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 blah. Switch camera sight X. I have a new idea. Yeah! Oh, hang on. What was that? Switch to like a... Okay, this is like got some... Uh, it's like very slight auto-aim. Keeps trying to point me up. He's not even there anymore. I don't know what this thing's smoking. What's the most common, uh, commonly abused drug in China? Other than communism. What kind of drug is a communism? <laughs> Downer. Whoa! This game's also got like a lot of weapons you just don't really see in any games. Because uh, H3VR's got a couple Chinese guns in it. I believe one of them is the Norinco. Which, uh, this might actually be the Norinco. I forget. It's like one of those things. You reckon the Chinese kind of don't... How, how they'll, like, bootleg a bunch of, uh... Pat, they'll just do downright copyright violations and stuff like that because they just don't care. You reckon it works in reverse? Like, could an American manufacturer make a replica of an Orinco Type 90 blah 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 and then sell that in the U.S.? Or would that hurt the investors? Oh, cloth physics, yes or no? Oh, yeah, baby, 2012! Hits me harder than Portland cement! Talk. What's the plan now? Portland, no, another communist it. country! Now that we're, hooked up with the others, we're here to ask you a question. Shot. Ten bucks says he gets shot. Oh, no, look at that. Oh, I've still got me shoddy. Oh, no, it's this part. This is what I was talking about. Oh, shoot. I may have just opened Pandora's dick. Eh, 
And I'm guessing that this is ammo for the shotgun. That I can pick up. But I don't want to, because I don't have to. Come on, focus your shot. Okay, we know what I said about it being a fairly accurate representation of a shotgun. I take that back. This shotgun can't do dick. Come on, get up! Watch your fire! Also, spinning around apparently takes you out of cover. La di da! Oh, that may have been a civvy. Don't care. There's eight billion. Wait, there's like two billion of you motherfuckers. You think that you're gonna miss one? Man, I sound like really rude. I and mean, I do I do feel bad for the people who have to live under Chinese regime. I really do. I mean I can sit here and say whatever I want more or less. The only thing I'm gonna get is a little community note on YouTube that says, You're an asshole. So yeah, well I'm an asshole who can still work and breathe and make decisions and own my own fucking guns. He's got a shoddy. He can't do shit at that distance. I'll hint your ass. Hello! Room service! Alright. What do we got? I don't know why the ammo pickup thing is O. That's all the way across the freaking keyboard. I guess we'll bleed through this ammo and then uh, sort of try to find our way after that. And we made a full freaking circle. This part is a pain. Because I'm not even really... Hint. Kane. Yeah, Kane solves a lot of problems, doesn't it? Alright. Get your shotguns. Load them up. Make sure you don't use a bullpup. Oh yeah. Where are we going? Don't want to swap this out just yet. Oh lord, I hate this place. I hate this place. I hate this place. I bait this haste. Um, because we had to. We have to. Nope. We just made another loop. Okay, so there is a loop. Can we? We can't take cover behind the grate, so we can't jump over it. I guess that's one way to funnel people. They're all hanging around, staring at the. The ghost of Christmas ass, I guess. Oh, blue door. What's behind door number 502, Johnny? Filthy fucking animals. Oh, I'm close, all right. Especially after I get a massage. Oh, pink part of the... Keep your eyes peeled, Kane. I hate that expression. Well, actually, I'm used to the expression. But have you ever pictured it? Keep your eyes peeled? I know it means like your eyelids peeled no back and open, but still, as a kid, I would just imagine somebody Check taking like a potato peeler to their See, eyelids and it, or not their eyelids, but their it. eyes, hey. always made me wince. Me. Ooh, two-dimensional custom tailored Chinese suits. Oh yeah, it's in vogue right now. Hint. Door. Sounds good to me. What's up? Beat it. It's your boy Kane. Mr. Singh, I'm Lynch. I know who you are. Tell me about the hit on the freeway. A you few hundred dollars me. in damage. Can I get anything out of him? No, back off. This is what I do. You're coming with us. I like the razor burn on his face. It's like he just kind of woke up that you day. It's like, well, water's off, <laughs> and then just burn the hell out of his Sudio. cheeks. What are you talking? You stupid man. You shoot wrong girl. What girl? Girl in market. Shang Tsung's daughter. No, that couldn't be. Shang Tsung is not happy. He will kill everyone. Isn't there a space between Thank every and one in that context? It's because of you, this changes everything. About but you one thing you'll notice about the way this story is designed or told is due to the uh, hard cuts you're meant to not really have all that much context Shit. or you have basically nothing but basic context oh yeah this whole game is fucked up real bad 
Okay, so if you press Q... Wow. Under some context, you do like an instant switch when you're in cover. I don't trust this as far as I can throw it. Considering it's a whole building, I can't throw it at all. Whoa! Hang on! I can't switch shoulders in this. Hang on, I'm reloading. Does location damage count with van? Yep. Alright. Owie. Who's getting me? Oh, yeah. You can crouch when you're in stand-up cover. Also, my laundry's done. Bye, bitch. Ah, the popo. Oh, not that one. Got into the wrong cover. And I'm still in the wrong cover. Oh, Lord, I'm in the wrong cover. I got my Chinese knockoff AK and it's got your name on it. Okay, you, you asked me if I'm medicated and, and not fucked up, and you aim like that? I agree. Okay. I figured that was a death the moment. Okay, so we're not going really through that door anymore. That van's broke. All right. Okay. Yep, trigger the enemy. Step back. Fortunately, I don't think they can get us if we're back here. Also, the cops don't seem to have that much health. I say that. Later on, you face up against, like, the SWAT and everything else, and it's a big old pain in the pukuki. Now, where's that guy that pinned me like... Oh, look at that! Why couldn't I do that last time? Ow! Okay, maybe it was him. Come on. How we doing? Okay. What kind of weapons... Uh, I guess we're going back to the Norinko question mark. Also another kind of shotgun. Yeah, never reload when you're standing out with your dick out. That's that's uh, that's generally a bad idea. Actually, that may that may be a precision rifle, not a shotgun. Excuse me? Was that your gun or your asshole after eating Taco Bell? Started more than a gang war. I gotta call Sue. Like moved up in started an international Working incident. Shang -Chi. Who? Shang -Chi. Literally means big boss. And we shot his Whoa, hey -oh. oh hush. Oh, double hush. With a side of gravy. Yeah. They've got automatics. That's ammo. If we need it, <laughs> if they don't have the right kind of ammo, we can at least pick up something new. Alrighty. Ooh. Hang on. This has a green light, which means go. Check your corners. Watch my six. Now what? Oh. Buddy system. You've reached Cricket Wireless Lynch. customer service. What have you got? Yeah, oh, man, I'm trying to think. I gotta call Sue. Put that away. Who is Shang Si? Tibet government official, the most dangerous type in the whole of fucking China. Not fucking China. Shit, I, can't stay here. I can barely stand regular China. This effect deal. No, not if we keep. Low. I think that was the wrong Damn. form of effect as well. I can't stand. It. Why is he coming out of my left ear when he was near my right? Did I have my cords re reversed again? It's me. Call me back. I now this is the PS3 back. demo. Do I want to go through this now or are we good? We got about 10 minutes, about 11 minutes till it's been an hour. I don't think it replays a cutscene if I were to end the video here. So let's at least get that far. Oh, I didn't have a choice. I didn't even push a button. I didn't do a synchronization click either. Oh, shit.
Oh well, we'll do it at the end. Why is your cigarette brown? Oh, shit! What? What the fuck? Now we get suppressed weapons, which do absolutely nothing. So, I think for the for the record, or at least for the sake of whatever, this is Shanghai. I am the Dave. Thank you very much for watching. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year if I don't post anything until then. And I hope to see you next time. I do not intend on getting drunk this year. What? Well, I screwed up a perfectly good outro for just throwing out some random information. Whatever. Have fun. Goodbye.